I spoke with a local law enforcement expert about what goes into these type of big political events. Secret Service, they definitely scope out these areas in advance, and we've learned the shooter, a man, was about 200 yards outside the security perimeter from an elevated position on top of a building, firing several shots around eight, and he was taken out by counter snipers. So Roy Taylor has a decade, several decades, decades of experience in law enforcement, military, and coordinating counterintelligence for big political events like presidential inaugurations. He tells us Secret Service, they are prepared to quickly respond. They are trained to do this and they did. They responded quickly covering Trump as he even got down as he heard those shots and uh, all the way till you can see him escorted to that armored vehicle in that truck. Taylor says there are various levels of protection, counter snipers, military, state police troopers and agents positioned throughout and around those venues. We have ways to block radio frequencies, cellular phones, so we can cut communications off when something like this happens so that if there is any other coordinated attack and they're trying to use regular types of cell phones or radios, we can uh, knock those out so that that helps eliminate one of the threats. So there's a lot of electronic countermeasures that are available to the Secret Service and the FBI for these type of situations so they can lock it down pretty quickly. Um, I'm sure they do have air support um, from the local police or the, the state police, most likely. So uh, they were able to spot that shooter. And we did see those helicopters in the air during some national coverage earlier this evening. Of course, now there is an in-depth investigation with federal agencies, Secret Service, FBI, ATF, among the law enforcement agencies who will investigate who the shooter was, his motive, how long did he plan this, cell phone video, and any connections that he might have to others. Taylor believes security measures will be increased at future rallies on the campaign trail. Lauren Dewan.